and dear students good morning welcome to online classes in the last class discussed the chapter number 14 electric current and its effect is completed now today we will discuss with the new chapter number chapter number 3 fiber to fabric fiber to fabric means a in the batte fiber to fabrics first one is what is fiber 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 it is a made up of two sets of strands arranged in a horizontally and vertical fashions vertical fashions horizontal and vertical fashions fiber are two sets of strands arranged in a horizontal and vertical of the basis the fiber are made up of silk of the both you have to learn this term learn in class 6 you have learned about the some fibers obtained from plants we get wool jute and cotton silk of the fibers next fiber is made of fiber fabric is made up of as arranged together as are made up of steel thinner strands called called fibers fibers means yellow in the fibers in the nav yellow in the yellow madu batte yellow in madu tayar na batte yellow tayar madu da kare kare to sasse gal in the yellow madu da na nav gal in the yellow madu thi tayar madu to da tayar or the tayar slab da kare no kare to example means cotton wool jute is the example fibers next one is the fibers several strands of fibers are made together of the strands of the fibers the and us of the fibers further made up of fibers of the jute of the wool cotton fibers are jute of the wool of the trees us fabric is made up of us arranged together next now today now let us discuss with the function of fiber function of fiber the fiber first one is point point you have you also learned that wool and silk fibers are obtained from animals wool and silk fibers obtained from animals wool and silk fibers wool means that unne matu en maduntha reshmi naavu galinda enna naavu galinda maduntha prani galinda en maduntha tayaristara kelinu karito ms wool and silk fibers wool means unne silk fibers andre reshmi naavu next second point is wool wool is obtained from the fleece or hair of a sheep or hair of a sheep or a yak wool is obtained fleece fleece means a tuppala dattavadanta kudaliruvanta tuppala hair of a sheep or a yak kuri athwa nanu antanta yak nalli enagutanta tuppala dinda enagutanta unne enu enagutanta tayaristara athwa bariyutara thelinu kaitu wool next one see third point is a silk fibers come from cocoons cocoons of the silk moth silk moth cocoons cocoons means a reshme boodu reshme na boodu kelene kaito silk moth silk moth means silk moth moth means a reshme patanga reshme patanga da patanga da boodu ninda nam yena antanda reshme yelegalanu yen maatanda tayaristara kelene kaito reshme ya yelegalinda reshme nele thelinu karito idu yen aagutade andre silk pass the silk fibers from a cocoons of the silk moth of the duck silk moth wool is a wool comes from the sheep goats and sheep goat yak and some other animals are used the wools next one is the the wool is a edging of the point of the the animals here 
from simple chemicals obtained from petroleum are called synthetic fibers are called synthetic fibers the synthesis of the industry of the simple of the chemical of the petroleum next 